Hey everyone, this is Vanessa, and today I'm going to be talking about the Babyless Pro Porcelain Ceramic Straightener. This straightener, as you can probably tell, I've had it for a while, but I really, really like it. Um, I've had it for like a few years actually, and it's still one of my favorite ones to use. On the website, the description of the product says um, that it offers an advanced form of ceramic technology with the finest commercial grade porcelain ceramic integrated into the heating surfaces of irons and dryers of irons gen generating far infrared heat less damaging than conventional heating process C porcelain ceramics superior heat distribution eliminates hot spots on plates and air outlet surfaces, while negative ions reduce static electricity and assist in breaking apart water molecules, decreasing styling time. With its improved heat distribution and increased far infrared heat and ion production, outperforms standard ceramic, leaving hair looking healthy, revitalized, and shiny. The Babyless Pro Porcelain Ceramic 1-inch Straining Iron features far infrared emitting, extended length porcelain ceramic plates with rostat temperature control up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. High heat ceramic heater provides instant heat up and recovery. And then some of the key features are porcelain ceramic plates that emit far infrared heat the temperature dial up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit and then instant heat up recovery and longer plates for faster wider section straightening. That was very long. I did not get for that to be so long. But that is what the website says. Like I said, I really love this hair straightener. It is a one inch straightener. The plates, it's got porcelain ceramic plates so it's not just porcelain and I really like it I really do think that it leaves my hair looking much shinier and smoother than like typical just ceramic plates the dial is hot it has a little red button so you know when it's or a little red light so you know when it's on and it just press that button I don't have it plugged in right now like I said but It's pretty standard. It's so just a little light that comes on, so you always know when it's on and when it's off. There's no light confusion, and it heats up so fast. Oh my gosh, it's like almost not touchable. And it was on for like two seconds. And then it has a dial. It's like that. Oh, it's hot. And then it has a dial. It goes up to 450 degrees. Just turn it. Highest heat is 450, and the lowest is 235. Goes up in increments of. It's not like a set increment, I guess. 50. It starts with an increment of 20, and then it just it goes up from there. I guess it's not really much rhyme or reason to that. This is not a dual voltage. It has some information in there. It's kind of hard to see it on the camera though. It's not dual voltage, so if you are planning on traveling though, you would need a converter in order to use this um, in other countries so that you don't ruin it or you don't like, blow a fuse or anything like that. Yeah, I think. For my hair, I do wish that this was a little bit wider, like maybe at least an inch and a half. Just because I have a lot of hair. But if you have pretty thin hair, if you just don't have a lot of hair, then this size would probably work really well for you. I do like that the heat goes up that high. Again, because I have very coarse hair. And it's really great. And it's really easy to turn that dial. This was made in China. It does give you some warnings. Like I said, there's some information on the inside of that. Kind of just like about where it's made and the voltage. It's 120 V 
voltage, and then AC 60 hertz, 300 watts. That's what this is. But yeah, overall, I just think this is a really, really great straightener. It's still hot, which is so crazy. It literally heats up like almost instantly. It's so crazy how fast it heats up. When I use it, I think that it definitely does decrease my styling time because I don't have to go over each section of hair a um, hundred times like with some other straighteners. So usually just once, maybe twice, and my hair is perfectly straight and smooth. But yeah, you can get this straightener pretty much anywhere. It's not super heavy. It's pretty light. It doesn't take up, because it is so thin, it doesn't take up much room. It's really easy to just throw it in a bag, throw it in your carry-on suitcase, and it doesn't take up much room at all, which is really, really great. It has a swivel cord, so any way that you turn it when you're doing your hair, you don't have to worry about the cord getting all tangled. It's going to move with you, which is really nice. I do wish that it had a hook. I love heating pot hair products that like have a little hook because then you can just hang it. But, I mean, it's really not that big of a deal. As you can see, like it is a little dirty. I did get like a scratch on there. I don't even remember how that happened. But just know, I think maybe because it's like porcelain, so it's, it's like susceptible to scratches like that. So just like be aware of that too. You might want to be a little careful. I'm honestly not sure. I don't remember how that even happened. Like I've had this for so long and it still works super, super great. So yeah, I definitely would recommend this straightener. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.